we met at the bar last night. You don't even remember? We had sex in your car. Remember. Science and truth can exist together, you see. We can learn a lot from nature. You know how a mama puppy cleans up after a litter by eating their waste? Mama made all her boys poop till we were five. It was unconventional, but it sure made us the people we are today. Social services said this had... Serve it grilled to members of your family and or tribe. I have been hunting since I was a small boy, and I can in fact track more than 16 different species of ruminant animal. While our olfactory senses have been dulled as hell by so-called civilization, in nature, all they gotta smell. I know how to simulate the odor of any species. I rub the pheromones all over my member. Trust me, when you have a young fawn experiencing his first adolescent flush of sexual awakening, run out of the woods filled with a yearning it scarcely understands, well, it really is something special when you grab it by the neck and strangle the life out of it. As his terrified eyes look up at you, it suddenly realizes, hey, you ain't my mom. Sure as shit ain't some young stag gonna gently educate the ways of the birds and the bees. <laughs> and in this way, you two really share... ...special moments. Terror takes hold of its central nervous system. And you put the creature out of its misery. You ever have deer sushi? A little rice and wasabi and some fine loin meat? I'll serve up on my stepdaughter just like they do in Asia. I am particularly interested in visiting Asia. I've always been kind to the Asiatic cultures of Kung Fu and martial arts and fucking throwing stars. I'd really love to see Thailand though. Somebody say ping pong? <laughs> Just saying, not judging. Ain't my way. Johnny, you are on the show. How can we inseminate you? Hey there, Dwayne. Big fan. Love the show. I love how it's educational and funny. I tell you what, if you've been one of my teachers, I'd have spent longer in school. I'd have learned something useful. As it is, I'm a trucker on the weekends. Oh, really? What you hauling, Johnny? Yeah, yeah, pollution. From a big leak they hushed up. Pays triple and I need the money. 69, 70, stop looking at my ass! I wasn't looking at your ass. I know. No one ever does. A little thin for my taste. But nice. What are you going for, a swim? What do you care? You think I got a fat ass and I only swim because I float easily? I was just making conversation. Doing a three-way. A what? A triathlon. Sounds like you got way too much time on your hands. F you. You like a stay-at-home cheerleader, do you? Pathetic. You know what? F you, bitch. I'll beat you. Come on. I promise. <laughs> I bet you like to beat women. I wonder why your ass is single. Perfect beach start. I got this locked in. Come on! Shit, you need a vacation or something, lady. I really ain't dressed for this shit. Admit it! You were curving my ass on the beach! Are you for real? That's cold. Don't be a baby. Mommy's not here. I'm your mama now. What are you doing, Marianne? Focus. Focus. T1, baby. 
babies. Here we go! Not enough in the tank. I should have tapered. Did you taper? What the hell are you talking about? Scaling down training before a race. Hey, you fucking tapered! You out of your fucking mind! The first I knew about this was seeing your skinny ass on the beach! I said you were checking me out! Time to lay down some fat butts! Are you with me? I said, are you with me? No! I am 100% not with you! Both survive. These things are about taking part, not winning, right? No, it is always about winning. All right, I gotta keep going. Some loser, fat, unmarried, career-driven loser. Hey, girl, you better chill the fuck out. Go to hell. <laughs> 